calculate the shaded area of each diagram. All measurements are in centimeters. So let's look at the first shape. So this is given to be 12 centimeters. This is 5 centimeter. This is 10 centimeter. And this is 4 centimeter. You can do this in two different ways, but I'm going to do it in only one way. So I'm going to split this into two rectangles. Okay, so this is, I'm going to split, draw a line here. And I want to find this area, the area of this rectangle and the area of this rectangle. Okay, so what can we do? So for find the area of a rectangle, you need base times height. So for the top, we know this is your base and this is your height. So it is very easy. So the area of the top, you can say area of, the top area would be 12 centimeters times 5 centimeters. It's a good practice to write the unit along with the measurement, so which is 60 centimeter squared. Okay, now we know the basis. Now we know this basis, how much? This base is 4. We need to find this height. Can we find this height? Well, this is 5. This length is 5. And the length from year to year is 10. So can we use this to, to find this? Well, that's easy. So that's 5 centimeters. So the area of this shape or this rect lower rectangle would be 5 centimeters times 4 centimeters or 4 centimeters times 5 centimeters which is 20 centimeters squared. So you can say the total area is this plus this which is 80 centimeters squared. Okay, so the next question, we want to find this shaded area. So let me write, say, make this into, split this into two rectangles. So this is the outside rectangle ABCD, and this is the inside rectangle PQRS. So how can you find the shaded area if you know the area of the outside rectangle and the area of the inside rectangle is something that you need to do think yourself so let's find the area of the outside rectangle well that would be abc that's the area of abcd okay so we know this is base of 18 centimeters and you got a height of 13 centimeter so this is 18 centimeter times 13 centimeters so use a calculator so 18 times 13 is how much? 234 centimeters squared. Okay, so and now how do you find the area of the inside? That is PQRS. Imagine this is a piece of wood which has been, you got a hole inside the middle. So what's this length? What's the base or this length? Well, we know from year to year is 18, and we know this length is 4, and this length is 5. So can we use these 3, 4 information to write what's this length? Well, that is 18 minus 9, because 4 plus 5 is 9, so this is 9 centimeters. Now what's this length, which is the height? We know B to C is 13. We know this is 3 centimeters, and this is 2 centimeters. So 13 take away 3 is 10, take 10 take away 2 is 8 centimeters. So the area of PQRS would be 8 times 9, which is 72 centimeters squared. So the shaded area, you have to do something with these two numbers. The shaded area would be the area of ABCD take away so I'll write like this so ABCD that means area of ABCD minus area of PQRS will give you the shaded area which is 234 minus 72 so let's again use a calculator 234 minus 72 equal 162 centimeters squared Okay, the next question. Now this is a semicircle. 
this is a semicircle and this is a triangle. So this is a triangle. So this is triangle. Area of a triangle is base times height divided by 2 and this is a semicircle. Semicircle. So what's the base? So let's start with the triangle. So this is the base for the triangle and this is the height. This is the height, so area. So area of area of triangle. So area of triangle is base times height, which is uh, yeah, this is the bit. You can also consider this the base and this the height doesn't matter. Okay, it doesn't matter what is the base. I can consider this the base and this as the height. Okay, so yeah, I should have considered this the base and this the height. Doesn't matter because it is base times height divided by 2. So 12 times 14 divided by 2. So let's use a calculator. So 12 times 14 divided by 2, which is 84 centimeters squared. Now, this becomes, for the semicircle, for the semicircle, this becomes what? Your 12 becomes the diameter. 12 is the diameter of the semicircle. This is the diameter. So, the, di 12, the diameter is 12 centimeters so your radius would be half the diameter which is six centimeter and so the area of the semicircle would be area of circle which is pi times r squared divided by two because you're finding half the area of the circle which is pi times six squared divided by two and uh, so this is how you do shift pi times 6 squared divided by 2 which is 56.5 centimeter which is 56.5 centimeter squared so i can say that the total area total area would be 84 plus 56.5 so let me use calculator 56.5 plus 84 which is 140.5 centimeters squared okay and the next question I think this is the last question this is a very complicated shape you can split this into two trapeziums but then you will have a problem with the trapezium so I'm going to draw drop this down so let us drop this down and see what happens so if you can find if you can find the area of this triangle now from the this has become a rectangle so let me write some letters so this is a b c d this is a b c d which is a rectangle this is the base which is six and this is the height so ABCD is the rectangle, is base times height, which is 12 times 6, which is 72 centimeters squared. Okay, now we want to find this, the area of this triangle. This, so let me write some letters so that, say, let me call this, say, D, and this is, say, F. Now, what's the height? What's, what's the height and what's the base? So, for this is the base. Can we find this base, the height of this or the length of this base? Well, we know this is 4 and the whole thing is this from A to D is 12. So, this from D to C would be 8 centimeters. Okay, we know this is how much? This is 6 and this is 3. So this would be how much? This would also be 3. So we can say area of DCF, that is a triangle, would be base times height divided by 2, which is 8 times 3 divided by 2. 
which is 24 divided by 2, which is 12 centimeters squared. So from A, B, C, D, so the shaded area, I'll say only shaded area, so let me write shaded area would be A, B, C, D, the area of A, B, C, D, which is a rectangle minus D, C, F, which is area of a triangle, which is 72 centimeter squared minus 12 centimeter squared, which is 60 centimeter squared.